Hey, it's your boy King Nation Nova Slate and Nova Chronicles. It's your boy Dysfunctional, Dysfunctional World. So, uh, we did the Courage Mail last time. We're going to do them again, double take. Today, we'll be doing Libra Woman and Aquarius Man Compatibility. You want to start off? It's a perfect match almost. They both love to be in relationships, they're both reasonable people. Aquarius want to be, no, Libras want to be in a relationship. They cherish relationships. And Aquarius is, they cherish friendship before relationship. So as long as they build it together, when they start, this thing can go on like forever. So the way I we, we, we pretty much describe the Aquarius male, I would stand by that, about conquering the world and not really trying to really raise a family too fast or really get foundation and stuff that the cancer wanted. When we're talking about cancer. Now with this matchup, there's so much friendly fire here. With friendly fire, it gives you uh, a chance to have the fire all pretty good and to be friendly. So these two couples will be friends. They have a friendship that will bond and be great. Because he finds what is fulfilling to him and her. And I'm going to tell you all a little trickery right here. A little mind manipulation on this. So if you're watching this channel or watching this one right in particular Zodiac, for other Zodiacs, you might want to peek this. A man that does not want a relationship with a woman, if he becomes friends with you and uh, it's a sexual friendship, he becomes a little bit jealous and you don't want to lose that aspect of what he has if it's great. Because nine times saying you're friends, that means you like to be around people. So with this aspect of the Aquarius wants to conquer the world and wants to not be rushed, not be pushed, if the woman does not push the man out the door, with all these confessions and everything, which the Libra does not do because she's more relaxed, more letting things go into motion, taking her time. I believe that Aquarius will actually chase that Libra woman. Hmm. But Libras have an inner beauty. So she's going to radiate anyway. You know what I'm saying? He probably will chase it for the pleasure and the lavish attractiveness that she brings to the table. But, she is the world that we talked about last time that he wants to conquer. Have you thought about that? She is the world that he does not contain because you do not contain a Libra so easily or so convincingly at first. So it's like a it's like a goal of capturing the beauty and the essence of this woman. Okay. She is the goal now versus the cancer who wants to say you have a home to stay and nothing to really conquer. You just come in and do what you got to do. This woman, you have to go after. I've talked to a Libra, a, a, a potent Libra, and I know it's a chase. It's a chase where you can't run too fast, and you can't run too slow either. You have to be right in that box. Otherwise, you'll push her away, or you'll lose track of her. Hmm. So with Aquarius, number one uh, goal to conquer the world, now he wants to conquer this woman. Yep. And he don't have her. You're not guaranteed to get this Libra wrong. Trust me. You're not, I don't care how fly you think you're. You're not guaranteed to get this woman. She's one of the most mysterious, not as in a Scorpio mysterious, but more, more or less like uh, the intangibles of creativity that, that plays with your mind and not knowing what she's thinking at times and unpredictable that you cannot just say, I got you. You never know they until you're locked in stone. They probably have music in common, mm -hmm. um, compassion, compromise. Um, the things that might that someone might find ugly or depressive, they won't find that in, in those in each other. Um, they have patience in common, and what does patience do? It allows you to build steadily. Also, it gives you insight. You can't tell me if you're patient, you can't see things better than people who are unpatient. So you see things better, and when you see things better, you can create better, and you can make things happen. You can see in the hours. So, with this being said, what's your opinion on these sites? I mean, on these two? This is going to be a first. Because on a scale of three, I don't think we've given any relationship a three yet. But I'm, I'm going to go out here and I'm going to say I give Aquarius male and female Libra a three. Hmm. Wow. So, uh, I really want to say three. I really, really want to say three. I don't want to be a hater. It's a positive score. You can tell my reaction is going to be positive, but I don't give it exactly a three because you never know how the query is going to be once he conquers the world. Even though he's known to stay where he want to be at, 
I give it two and a half. Mm -hmm. One half away from being a perfect score. So don't get mad at me, Aquarius Levers, because I know y'all got some lasers out there who are working. I just can't give it a perfect score because I don't think it's a perfect, this is the perfect combination ever. It's some messed up people out there. Mm -hmm. I won't say what Zodiac sign messed up, but <laughs> it could be any of them. But it's your boy, Ken Nation over Slayton. No promise. This functions world. Logging out. Peace. Peace.